Hello, and welcome to another QSM tutorial. Today, we will be learning how to use the QSM Quiz Proctor add-on, and we will see how to install and how to use the add-on, and see the violations recorded during an online exam as a Quiz Proctor report. Quiz Proctor add-on provides you automated monitoring of online examinations. So let's get started. We are using the InstaWP website for this tutorial. To learn how to create and install an InstaWP website, click on the banner on the top right corner of your screen. Once it has been set up, you can have a one click magic login to your WordPress website. Now let's add the QSM Quiz Proctor plugin to our website. All you need to do is upload the zip file in your plugins menu on your WordPress website and it will be installed. After completing the installation, activate the plugin to use it. Now hover to the QSM add-ons and go to Quiz Proctoring Settings. Here you can add your license key and use it to initialize your Quiz Proctor add-on. Now let's get started with the Quiz Proctoring. Choose any quiz that you have created. We are going with this general knowledge trivia quiz. We have already added some questions here so we will straight up head to the Quiz Proctoring Settings. We are using different kinds of monitoring methods. First, we are enabling the camera. Here you can set the frequency of screen captures of the quiz taker throughout your quiz. Here we are using a frequency of 5 seconds, which means that in every 5 seconds a screen capture would be recorded through the quiz taker's camera. If you choose this feature, the quiz taker will be asked for camera permission. Next, we have the enabling full screen mode. When you enable, this user won't be allowed to minimize the full screen of the quiz, and if the quiz taker tries to do so, a warning message will appear. Then we have the detect tab switching mode. Here the user won't be able to switch tabs while taking the quiz and this violation will be supported with a warning message. Lastly, you can prohibit copy and pasting text. In this, the quiz taker won't be able to copy or paste any text to or from the quiz window. Finally, just save your add-in settings and publish the quiz. Now let's view the quiz. As you can see the browser asks the quiz taker to permit the camera settings for the quiz and here we have enabled it and as soon as the quiz starts, the quiz window will appear in full screen mode. Here we are entering some details according to the contact form. Once the quiz has started your quiz window will stay in the full screen mode which cannot be exited. Now we will try to exit the full screen mode, and as I did, this warning message has appeared, and this violation has been recorded. Let's resume the quiz. We will quickly solve this quiz. After completing the quiz, let's go to the results menu from the QSM dashboard, and go to Proctor Reports. Here we can check out the user details of every quiz result. Further we can see a detailed report of this quiz. In the violation report, we have user details, number of violations captured, and time taken for completing the quiz, and we have a time tracking report for the same. You can view the images captured during the whole quiz. You can also see how long the user proceeded with a violation. For example, we exited full screen voice for 6 seconds, and this is how your quiz proctoring report looks like with the QSM proctor add-in. Hope you enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching. <laughs>